All right, so in this video, I'll be looking at uh, number nine on worksheet number two. Just like in the previous videos, I'm gonna do, what I'm going to do is start by drawing my object. All right, so the view that is missing here is my front view. It should look like this. It looks like my front view comes across, then down, then flat, and down. All right, so I'm going to grab this point here and start by going to the left five, up. 2.5. I'm just going to create a new document. Part 9. Hit OK. I'm going to add a new sketch to my front view. You notice I get that view plane. On my left hand side I can click these eyes here to turn those planes off. I'm going to click on front on my view plane and now I'm ready to begin. Line tool, for my start point, I always start there. I go to the left, type in 5, hit enter. It goes up, I type in 2.5, I hit enter. I look at my part, this line here comes across 1. Um, but then I run into an angle, so I'm going to free draw these next three lines. So it comes down over here, comes to here, and to there. Right. On my blueprint, this line here is 2 inches, so I can click on that line, go up, that's 2 inches. This line here has a 1 and a quarter or 1.25 vertically and horizontally, right? So this height here is 1.25, this distance here is 1.25. What I'm going to do is click dimension, click this point and this point and go to the right. I hit 1.25. Click it again, that point, and that point, but this time I'm going to go up. Right? 1.25 and hit enter. So that gives me a black bound object with all my dimensions. It's grayed out, so I'm ready to hit that green check. I like to do my extrusions from the isometric view. Click on extrude, click on my part. My extrusion for this one, right, so this is the front of my object. My extrusion is one and a half, or 1.5. My green check, and there it is, part number nine on worksheet number two. Thank you.